One of the worst things about owning a dog is that our beloved companion's lifespans are much shorter than ours. It is rare for a dog to live for 20 years, and most dogs don't even live this long. Bigger dogs typically live shorter periods than smaller canine companions, but there are plenty of exceptions, and all dogs are individuals. While most dog breeds have a typical lifespan, that doesn't necessarily tell you how long your particular dog will live. If you want to know 5 things you can look for that can help you determine whether your dog is nearing the end of their days, keep watching the Pets Guideline videos. Number 1. Loss of Interest When a dog approaches the end of his lifespan, he can begin to lose interest in the world around him. This is especially true of dogs who suffer from a long-term, chronic illness. Toys he once loved will gather dust, and he might not jump up to greet you at the door anymore. In fact, this is often one of the first signs that your canine's quality of life is beginning to decrease. This is, unfortunately, a common symptom associated with your dog's body slowing down. A loss of interest in previously enjoyable things and activities is usually due to multiple reasons. Firstly, your dog is likely to feel more tired than usual, which will decrease the amount of time he feels like playing. It may also be painful for him to move around too much, especially if he has arthritis or joint pain. Finally, even when not in pain, it is also common for old or dying dogs to experience problems with mobility. He might be extra cautious on slippery floors or have trouble judging distance. Number 2. Loss of Coordination It is very common for dogs to lose coordination as they reach the end of their lifespans. They may not have the muscle strength they once did, which can affect their balance. Furthermore, they may have trouble judging distance or suffer from less than stellar eyesight. These factors can make them much clumsier than usual. There are countless disorders that can also cause a loss of coordination, including dehydration. If your pooch is experiencing gastrointestinal symptoms and then a loss of coordination, it could just be that he's dehydrated. But your canine developing more than one of these symptoms is worrying. Number 3. Depression. Dogs that are dying will often experience many of the symptoms of depression. This is not necessarily because your dog knows he is dying. Instead, it is likely that he simply doesn't feel well. He may, for example, stop doing things he once loved cease responding to your attention become withdrawn exhibit changes in his sleeping patterns lose interest in walks or trips to the park. While dog depression is treatable during other occasions, it may not be easy to address as your dog approaches the end of his life. Number 4. Odd Breathing When a canine is very close to death, his normal bodily functions may begin to break down. This can cause him to breathe in an odd manner. This is actually true for humans too. If you've ever been at the deathbed of a loved one, you may be familiar with the irregular breathing that commonly accompanies an individual's end-of-life hours. Your dog's breathing may be very slow or very fast. It may be normal for a bit and then become labored before returning to normal again. He may also simply have to work hard to move air in and out. Number 5. Appetite Changes Dogs who are close to the end of their life will often experience a change in appetite. They may even stop eating altogether, which is the most common leading to intense weight loss. Just like humans, dogs will often stop eating when they feel bad. If they also have gastrointestinal problems, their appetites may decrease simply because they don't feel well. A loss of appetite isn't always a sign of death in dogs, though. Almost all diseases and simple stress can cause changes in appetite. If you like this video, Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon.